Alright guys, welcome back to more PES 2016. So today we're going to be against Fulham at home. Big clash this because Fulham are right up there um, at the top of the table with us. So um, yeah, well near the top of the table with us. So yeah, big game this one guys. Um, I've put Redmond in the team today and I think I've put on agenda up front. And did I take Coutinho out? I think. I kind of want to say that. But um, yeah, everything's going pretty well guys. Um... We, I mean, we absolutely dominated Charlton in the last game, so let's see what happens today. Where to from here? Now the pass. Oh, oh crap! Get in there! Oh man, that could have been a goal. Look straight away. Tries a through ball out towards the flank. Oh, don't let him cut inside. Oh, what? And they did. A pretty simple finish in the end. What do you think, Jim? Well, we've just seen it. Doesn't really surprise me, to be honest, guys. It really doesn't. I knew because, like, you know, we, you could tell that that was going to happen because they're trying to sort of, like, fake cross it, cross the ball in there. And then they kind of all lined up, the Fulham players, and then if you just give one of them an inch. You know I mean? If you try to defend the near post... You know, they're just going to try and cut away from you and get that little bit of extra space they need to, to sort of find the back post. But if you try to cover the back post, they're going to go for the near post. It's like, if they've got they've got men in the box as well. I mean, look at this right here. I'll, I'll show you what I mean. I mean, look, look at the Fulham players there. There's four of them lined up in a row. I mean, there's four of us, but... Uh, to be honest, our, our midfield needs to come further back there to help help them out, but it's too late now. Shoots. Oh, good save. From, uh, that was a good shot by Redmond. Can we whip a ball in here? Arcas is going to put it in. No, no, we can't. But Gazzy is going to have a crack. Oh, never mind. Defending, but do. He's got many names. There's um, Jizor, G, uh, whatever his name. I don't even know. To be honest, guys, I'm not even going to try. And oh, it's wide from Red. No, it's Arcas. Never mind. Could have been better. And. A good shot, and surely... Oh, how do you miss? Seriously, how do you miss that? I think it was Redmond. Oh, what? What? How do you... What? How do you miss that? No, seriously, we've been terrible in front of goal so far. Chew. Oh, come on. Back to you. Chew again, and there's a goal. And that was just easy enough done there, to be honest, with the second attempt. You know what I mean? The Fulham weren't really trying to press for the ball there. Fair shot blocked. Gets it back. You know, Fulham's defence is kind of lined up. It's kind of the similar situation to the first goal that we conceded, but you know, we've took it the other way and, and popped it in. It's exactly what I was talking about earlier, guys. You know what I mean? That we've, well, we've gone for the near post already, so in this situation we kind of had to work something different. I mean, I could have probably tried the near post again, but it was just easier to, to try the back post that time because I already had one shot. But yeah. Oh come on! Go on! What? 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 With a what? What was that? Like what was that? Honestly, what was that? It's just ugh. this game makes no sense. Sometimes, uh, another corner, I think. 
Oh, come on. Like, I honestly just don't understand this game at all. Go on! Oh, wide! Come on, get it on target, man. This game is just unreal at times, it really is. Oh, come on, Coutinho, finish it! Oh, what? You don't put it at the keeper. That is the last thing you want to do. Oh dear. Come on, just put a good ball in here. Here's Zanev. And it's going to be batted away from somebody's head. Don't know who it is. <laughs> and here's Oni. 91st minute. Ah, oh, never mind. I don't even think we've used any subs, to be honest, guys. I've kind of lost track of the time in this match. Oh, come on. This would be a great time to get a winner. Ah, oh, it looks like we're not going to get it now. Never mind, guys. I'll tell you what, though. Fulham have put up a good fight today, but you know what? We should have made more of the chances, uh, in my opinion. Unless there's something here yet. Yeah. Don't know yet. Redmond! Oh, oh! Come on, we're still in this one. We've still got a corner. And to be honest, there was really no... There was no point in hitting that. You never know, guys, yet. Is that going to be another corner? It is. 97th minute now, guys. Holy hell. And that's going to be the full-time whistle for sure. Never mind. It's uh, going to be 1-1. You know what? It's a fair result. It is a fair result, that one. Oh, well. Uh, well played, Fulham. That's all I'm going to say with that. And, uh, yeah, 17-10 on target. Seven, 17 shots, 10 on target, 1 goal. Fulham, 1 shot, 1 on target, 1 goal. Unbelievable. And their keeper got the man of the match because he was like Superman to do. Yeah. Alright guys, so uh, we're at the Wolves game now, so this will be the uh, second game and final game of the episode. So, um, yeah, fair result with Fulham in the last one. Um, I think I've got on agenda up front. And I think, did, I put, I think I put, did I put Redmond into the midfield? I, I'm, I'm loving Redmond, Redmond, guys. He is actually a really good player. Um, so, yeah. Wolves, um, they're sort of up there, aren't they? So we need a good result. Oh, just off target, just this past that far post. Never mind, it's a good early start. But it was just, uh, oh, it was way off. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. Oh, come on, don't book him for that. Not Arky. Was it really that bad? Oh, come on, it wasn't that bad. Tapped him. Oh, he's found a way through. Oh, Oni, never mind. He did really well there. And it's not even a goal uh, corner. Wow. Come on, Brown the keeper, and in, get in there, what a goal. Oh, just got to that in time before the keeper could. That was brilliant, Yankoff with a goal there. I tell you what, it's been a really boring, dull match this, guys. It just sparked it up a little bit, for sure. Definitely has. We'll have a look at this one again, for definite. A bit of pass in there. On agenda's picked him out. He's just running through that gap in the defence. So, you know, he put a through ball through. Around the keeper, he's out. Defender sliding in. He can't do anything about it. That was a, a really well worked goal there. It's the result we need as well. If it stays like this. Oh no, what? 
How did they get through that? Oh, come on. Nowhere. That is just total, total crap, honestly. They shouldn't be getting through that. They really shouldn't be. Like, how many of our defenders were there? Let's have a look at this. I mean, our number... Uh, number 18 they're supposed to be covering him. He didn't. Number 2 can't get back in time. It's total balls. And get in there. Thank you on agenda. That puts us back where we should be. I think... I'll tell you what, he's passing, he's been good, he's really good at winning the ball back, his on agenda, gets himself into the right areas, good positioning, and that, and I'll tell you what, that's what gets him goals and, and thing, gets him assists as well. And, uh, you know what I mean, I want on agenda to play more games, because, you know, I mean, he's a best, he's a definitely our best man up front, I mean, Yankov's great, and Harves is great, Coutinho, I'm not, he's not a t t too great, in my opinion, he's not as good is the rest in my opinion and that's why I've kind of been dropping him lately but um, you know, just a touch into the box shot goal Sometimes when the body becomes tired the brain goes with it and, I think that's oh, and again and again ah oh, never mind I oh, can't cut inside we're at the end of the match here now Oh, hello. Oh, I can't pick him out. Oh, that's not good. We've still got it. Is there going to be anything here? Oh, we've won the ball back again. And it's Cavalcanti. Oh, and even he gets one. Even our centre-back gets one, guys. Well, would you believe that? I certainly can't. <laughs> That is just amazing. And again, we just kind of win the ball back easily and get in there and score. Let's have a look at it again. I mean, he's up there. Gets it back for us. Just turns, got that little bit of space. And again, the goalkeepers, the dive is pathetic. And uh, that definitely ends off this match, guys. There could be another one here, though. No, no, there won't be. And anyway, there we go. 3-1. Uh, I, I love the uh, the round rounding the keeper goal, though. I think that was probably our best goal. Um, on agenda play brilliant today. Let's see what the stats have to say. We, had, uh, we only had five shots, three on target. They only had... And again, guys, one shot. One on target, one goal. Wow. Um, on agenda 7.5. I agree with that. He was our man today. Anyway, guys, looking at the league table. Um, yeah, it's us and Cardiff that are sitting on 34 points. Same amount of wins, same amount of draws, same amount of losses. Just the goal difference separating us. We've got five more than Cardiff at the moment. So uh, QPR Hull not sitting too far behind. And as you can see, they're Fulham and Wolves not sitting too far behind. And I think we've got Rotherham next too. So yeah. Anyway guys, going to have to thank you for watching this episode today. As you can see in the next one, we're at Rotherham, who sits 7th in the table, and a massive clash against QPR. So things heating up now, guys. And um, as uh, our rivals are not too far off us in the league, so if we string together a few wins, we can um, pull away from them, hopefully. So yeah, into December now, guys. So, uh, yeah, halfway point of the season nearly here. Thank you guys for watching. Call, rip, subscribe, and share as always. I'll see you next time for a bit of Rotherham and a bit of QPR at home, guys. See you then.